Was there, uh, I thought you had a pretty good road trip. I mean, throw away Sunday at three and three, but there's some momentum uh, uh, building from that. You maybe? know what, honestly, I, I didn't, I thought we played really well Sunday. To be honest with you, it was a, uh, a better 60 minutes um, than it was Saturday. Obviously, we had the big comeback. Uh, we had a good game Friday. Uh, had to come from behind down one nothing, and then, uh, um, you know, the late goal in the power play. But uh, Saturday, a little different story. I think probably too wide open for both teams. Uh, a lot of chances. They were all over us in the first, and we found a way to come back. I think that was a that was a huge boost and can certainly be a, a confidence builder for us, knowing we, we've had two games where we were able to come from behind. And then really, honestly, Sunday, I felt like, uh, we were going to do it again. I think we got past the 10 minute mark and we had some real good chances at three, two. So, uh, definitely came out of the weekend feeling, um, uh, good about ourselves. And we knew this was going to be a good test against the, uh, you know, a team that's right there in the division, you know, Toronto was the same thing. You don't want to give up three points to them, but, uh, we, we certainly were happy with the way we played. And then tonight we knew it was going to be a good test. And, uh, I think we were ready. They you know, obviously, I don't think they were sharp as they wanted to be, but we we were. It's good to see us score some goals because we certainly had a lot of chances over the last three games that didn't go in. Yeah, and plus you got the power play is working. Not only the three power play goals, but you had I mean, four and four, and then you had one right after the power play. Too. Yeah, yeah. I, you know, they were buzzing, moving the puck pretty good, and um, you know, lapping out of the lineup tonight he was one of our best pp guys and one of our best players over the course of the weekend too so you know going in against the first place team in your division uh you know we had some guys step up and and do a good job on it but that that uh you know lapin was on that first unit over the course of the weekend uh, but you know gibbons is an easy shift into there because of his skill level but i like the way they move the puck and uh, again, you know, uh, a lot of shot or shot attempts, which is certainly good to see on the PP. Can the third period be hard to play in a game like this? Yeah, you know, we talked about it, you know, me and Sergey about as I – I hated this these types of games as a player because I just didn't want to get scored on. I didn't care about any more points. I just didn't want to make a mistake. And, you know, they are they probably got an earful, so they got some guys that are buzzing and, you know, playing some guys that maybe don't get as much ice time, and you have a tendency to kind of let your foot off the gas. And as a coach, you just don't want to deviate from your structure. And I just kept telling the guy to keep – keep using their legs you know don't slow down when the other teams so we gave up more chances than we want and obviously the goal right in the slot is, is something we don't want to give up but uh certainly is uh when you got a comfortable lead like that especially with a, some young players that tend to uh let up a bit what is there going on with Lampen? just sick awesome. yeah yeah uh, pietola pietola no upper body um won't be available this weekend and uh, the only other one is Mandat, who's sick as well right. after the trip. So, so you really didn't have lineup options then? Really? No, we didn't. We were uh, we're down to 12. Uh, the only healthy scratch here right now. Gormley should be back tomorrow after being sick uh, and missing the weekend. Um, and then uh, McDonald's, McDonald's the only scratch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, did the gas get shaken up there in the fight? Uh, no, his, 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 his hands, he blocked a shot a while ago in his hands. Uh, uh, been a little sore and he just re-aggravated. It's nothing. But it was just a matter of you know we're up six nothing. No reason to come back and and uh, play the third period. Is the uh, and you have some uh, good teams coming in here and another very quick stretch at home. And then you're on the road for a while. Is the message maybe try to try to take advantage of the home ice while you have it? Yeah, absolutely. You know we we've, we've kind of gone back and forth where we've been home and then we you know we head on the road for three. But uh, you know uh, like you said. It's, Pete, some real good teams, best team in the league right now coming in here Friday. Uh, so we're going to have our hands full and quick turnaround. Bridgeport's playing oh, unbelievable. They got Halak in that now. Uh, and then a division game on Monday. So kind of a, again, just it's just been steady for us for so long here. And uh, hopefully we can continue to get healthy, uh, you know, and clean up this homestand. And then we head to another, uh, you know, division opponent in St. John's for two. 6-1 game. Do you worry about the chippiness in the third period and anyone getting hurt? Yeah, that's the only thing you worry about. You, just, you know, I just told the guys to make sure they're looking, keeping their head up. And again, in those games, if you just keep moving your feet and move the puck and, and keep it out of the middle of the ice, it, you know, we really wanted to have about as boring period as we could in the third. Um, but we made it a, maybe a little more exciting than we needed to. Uh, but yeah, you, you just you just worry about guys getting hurt or you know, guys uh, letting their guard down and, and, and getting tagged. And that's the last thing we need right now.
I'm sure you're thrilled with 6-1, but are you looking at that shot out and not getting the, that shot out? Personally, yeah. I, I, you know, you want to, you certainly want to do it for your goaltender, but you want to do it for your, your team stats as well. And uh, like I said, you know, we have, we go to sleep a little bit and let a guy with a pretty good shot all alone in the slot. But uh, nonetheless, it was a, a solid effort and got contributions from a lot of guys tonight and um, uh, certainly a big win.